We have a total right now of 78 house plants in our house. Well, a couple of them are out on the porch, but 78 house plants. We love house plants. They give a lot of oxygen and life to the inside of the house. We don't have any yard space where we can really have a garden anymore. So house plants have taken up that space. And I wanted to tell you about one of the rules I have about keeping house plants. And that is always be propagating, ABP. Uh, at any given time, I have five or six different things propagating, and I propagate things continually for three reasons. Number one, just to get more plants, because what we have, I would like to have more of. So more plants is always better. So that's number one reason to always be propagating. Number two is to hedge your bets against something going wrong. We had a begonia a while back that we really, really liked, and it died because we were giving it tap water instead of rainwater and didn't know whatever and now we've lost that begonia so now as a way to hedge my bets against anything happening uh, whether it's pests and disease or water and a care issue and a light issue or a pet chewing on it whatever you always want to hedge your bets if you have your plant you really really love propagate it and the third reason to always be propagating is so that you'll have plants to give away we go to Goodwill and the thrift stores and buy pots. Most of the pots that we have these plants in, we paid a dollar, two, three, four uh, at the Goodwill store. So we don't have to go out and spend a bunch of money on a really fancy pot. And some of them are kind of cool vintage pots too. But that way we always have healthy plants in a pretty little pot that we can give away to someone. Uh, not too long ago, we had somebody come and buy a piece of furniture from us. Uh, from Facebook Marketplace and when she came in she said oh wow look at all the beautiful house plants I love house plants and da, da 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 and I was able to say well hey how would you like to have a snake plant do you have a snake plant and she said no and I said well here you go take one because it was in a pot that I had spent like a dollar on you know and it was just divisions off of the plant that we already had because we have a huge snake plant and uh, you know I'm always doing pothos I have some jade propagating I have some ivy Here's some wandering Jew. There's some jade or uh, ivy that I dug up out of the front yard that I'm propagating that. Uh, I've grown a couple avocados. Uh, I have some other pothos that I've divided up. And so always be propagating if you love houseplants. Enjoy.